Boom. We get to here, we fly right in. Big sink. So from here, if we feel like this guy isn't giving cradle or he pops his head out right away, the second he pops head out, I'm going to, as I start to feel, as I start to feel his head popping out, so sometimes they'll literally let go of their lock and start to push your leg up once you've done this a couple times. So number one, if you haven't sank real deep and he starts to let go of his lock, I'm just gonna throw. So that's pretty easy if they, if, they, if they try to avoid what's coming. But if you commit this hip, if you commit this hip and he starts to go head outside, boom, I'm into the rolling. And right here, watch this. If he holds on to my leg, no problem. I'm going to do this. I'm going to land him, and I'm going to try to touch my knee and my hand, and I'm going to end up in a cradle. So right, I'm going to fly this down his leg, and I'm going to try to land him here. And as I do this, I'm going to scoot, scoot, scoot. I'm going to scoot, scoot, scoot. Here's my cradle. I step up. I land on top of the cradle. That's if he holds on. Now most guys will not. So if they don't hold on, this is the. I turn. He pops his head out. Here, he doesn't hold on, he tries to crab walk. I slice down his leg. As I come over, this hand catches me, and right when I slap the mat, I have to keep this high, and I'm going to scoot. Right here to this inside position. When the scramble in the middle. So one more time on that one, because it's a little different. I catch, he pops, I roll, he pop, here. And they can hold on to your knee, whatever, or leg, whatever. Not a big deal. We're coming up. 